Hey guys, I'm Lennon and Minion, and today I'm going to be showing you guys how to make glitter slime. So let's get started. The supplies you'll be needing is a plate or a bowl to mix in, and something like a popsicle stick or a little spatula, spoon, or whatever you prefer to mix with is what you'll be needing. You'll be needing slime activator, which is detergent and water or borax. I recommend not using borax. So I am just basically using some game detergent. The next thing you'll be needing is you'll be needing some glitter glue. Or if you don't have glitter glue, what you can do is you can get some clear glue and throw in some glitter. So you'll be needing that. And it's a very simple recipe. So let me just show you guys how to make this slime and let's get started. Alrighty then guys, we're gonna start off by pouring in our glue onto our plate or a bowl. I'm just using a plate because it's easier. Come on glitter glue. Excuse me, glue farted once again. In almost every slime video I use glue, but my glue always seems to fart. So I'm gonna get all this glue out of here, so I'm gonna go on pause. Well guys, that took a really long time to get all that glue out. It kept like going back into the bottle, so it was just really crazy. So I'm gonna mix both of these, both, both of these glues together. I added in just a little bit extra glitter for some color here. And that is very, very vibrant. It's a bit dark on camera, but it's really nice in person. So, yes, guys, let's just mix more. All right, so that is very good, good, good glue. So let's just get a nice close-up here. That's just great. So I gave you a nice close-up so you guys could see. All right, so let's just put that right there. And now it's time to add in a little bit of some slime activator here. Oh. All right, guys, so let's just pour in a little bit of some activator. It's spilling everywhere. All righty then. As you guys can see, there's just a little bit of some green activator there. And it's already starting to slime up. So let's just mix that together. And you have to mix up really well and slowly add your detergent. Because if you add a lot at once, it will just become very watery and pretty sticky but if you want and you think it will speed up the process go right ahead and add a lot i'm adding in just a little bit more of my slime activator because that wasn't enough the first time and i'm just gonna mix and keep on mixing this is a bit time consuming so it's definitely still sticky. So we might have to be adding a little bit more of some slime activator. A lot of people for their slime activators, they use borax and water. But since I don't have borax on hand, I just use detergent. And I've been using detergent lately in a lot of my last slime videos. And just so you guys know, you can use Tide detergent, Persil, I know that sounds a bit funky, or per seal. I don't really know how to pronounce it here. All right, let's just keep on mixing. My hands are pretty dirty, so let me just wipe them off here. All right, okay. Sorry, I just had a little bit of glue on there, and it was just bugging me, guys. It's very slippery here. So we're just gonna keep on mixing. Oh yes, the color has became a little bit lighter. Now I'm just gonna add in a little bit more of our slime activator here. All right, and I guess because the slime activator is green, it might be a bit green, but it's, it didn't seem to affect the color of my glitter glue. So that's pretty good, right? This is a bit harder to mix because the outside of my plate is pretty slippery. Oh, okay. I guess
Yes, we can start mixing with our hands now. It's a bit sticky. Okay, so as you can see, it's really sticky right now. So just knead and knead and knead. Let me just wipe off my hand real quickly, guys. Get all that gunk off. Because that's just gross. And I just got the gunk all over my shirt. Not very smart, guys. Not at all. So let's just add in just a little bit more activator like so. Oh, sorry. It's out of the view there. Sorry about that. So I'm just going to keep on mixing. Okay. Righty then. Now that there's a little bit of some slime activator in the bowl, we might be able to mix with our hands now. So, as you guys can see, if you're making this slime while watching this, sorry, excuse me, all you have to do is basically just keep on mushing it and squishing it. And it will be very bubbly, as you guys can see. Like, there's a lot of those little soapy bubbles because of the detergent. So I'm going to be showing you guys how to fix that. So just for now, just keep on kneading with your hands. Or if you don't want to get them dirty, just keep on using that little mixing tool. Let's just keep on kneading and kneading. That glitter looks very beautiful. Which is perfect. It's exactly what we need. So, oh. Alrighty guys, so let's just move this plate over there. Our slime at first will be sticky. But all you have to do is just keep on kneading. And as you guys can see, there's no more of those little bubbles of all those nasty detergent bubbles. Well, there is some on my hands, but that's okay. That looks very satisfying. So you can roll it out on the table and then just toss it around a little bit so yeah i hope you guys enjoyed me making this glitter glue slime and hope you guys try this out for yourself because it's way cooler than normal slime i don't know why i guess because there's glitter in it it just looks more satisfying to me but that's just my opinion so comment down below if this slime is more satisfying than just regular colored slime like this video if you tried it out for yourself or if you actually like the video. And just subscribe for future videos like this on me making some slimes. And yet, yeah, it's only two simple ingredients. All you need is slime activator and some glitter glue. Or, then again, if you do not have glitter glue, just put in some clear glue or white glue and mix in some glitter. So I love you guys all so much and bye-bye. <laughs> you guys knew that was coming. Bye.